So we're going to look at a Deflefs Trend T6757 DBL, I suppose that stands for double, double bed and the payload on this one is 528 maximum authorised weight is 3,499 that's a little bit different <laughs> I suppose they mean don't go up to 3,500 it's a smart looking fan isn't it it's on a 140 brake horsepower engine it's got the nice wheels I'll sit on can't see what base van it is either a Peugeot, a Citroen or a Fiat Oh, it's a Fiat. Medium-sized garage. Probably going to struggle to open that. No, can <laughs> can you do the bottom one, guys? That's it. Oh, that's good size, isn't it? Yeah. What's going on there? <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> No reversing camera as far as I can see. I'm find the family. <laughs> That's my German for today. That's a big wide door, you know. I was thinking that is a big wide Yeah, a nice big wide door. Yeah. Very nice. Reasonably high up, you know, that step. Yeah. Nice grab handle. Ooh, what we got here then? It's always great when you go in a completely new layout and you think, oh, what we got? Yeah. <laughs> so where do you start? Where do you start? What we do? <laughs> that probably have a look at the lounge. It's got one of these folding tables that always, to me, makes far more sense than those great big things. You can get in here. Yeah. Yeah, and it moves. And it, it moves out the way. way. Yeah. These seats make into travel seats, as far as I can remember with these. And so does this. And that one as well. That's thing. just a lap. No, well, no, is it's it? not. No. no. It's a belt coming from there. So okay. It's not a lap belt, isn't it? Yeah, I'm not going to do it. but. No. no. Uh, drop down bed. You wouldn't believe that's a drop down bed, would you? No. Is that is really same. well put in there. And it's, if you look at the cupboards yeah. underneath it, they're nicely lined they're up. They're all lined the up. Over there, yeah. Which proves it's you know in the right place. Yeah. And I walked in here and didn't bang my head. Yeah, you did. There's bonus points for that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right, let's then move on to the kitchen. Okay. Yeah. <coughs> well, there is of a kitchen here because there's no. Oh, I spoke too soon. There's a tiny little Thetford up there. Slimline fridge. That's quite good. Mainly drawers over here. Very nice cutlery drawer. That's nice, isn't that it? That is an excellent cutlery drawer. Bring loads of knives and Not, yep. everything with that. Huh? Yep. Uh, a little bin. A little, little bin. <laughs> <laughs> your drop controls for your drop down bed are there. Yeah, but you need a key. Yeah, so I won't be doing that. Sink. Inline hob. Yeah. 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 Not a lot of. Not a lot of that. Space, but, but yeah, headroom, brilliant. Yeah, yeah. Sliding door. Very good. Alright, so this is a. What would you call these sort of bathrooms? Like a boudoir, aren't they? They've got, you've got a toilet rather bizarrely there. Yeah, Lucy points for that because how on earth? Oh goodness! No, there's nowhere I can sit down. I can't, you can't sit down on there. No. Well, I can't. You might be able to. Sorry. <laughs> so minus point. Yeah, minus point for that. You have to yeah. use the toilet. You have to close that off and go in there. So if you want to go to the toilet in the middle of the night no, and you don't want to embarrass your partner, you've got to. Um, you've got to get them out of bed. No, you've got to get them out well, of bed. Well, you don't. They don't want to sit there watching you do no, your business. No, you, you close that. Round no, you, you can't. That's what I'm saying. No, you you can't. can't. 
Go on, let's, let's see you do it then. Come on, you must be able to. It's a bit tight here. <laughs> Go on, you try and sit down now. Oh, this is ridiculous. Oh, come on, Def Left, you were doing so well as well. I can just about sit down, but now I can't get out of the you, you didn't try to sit down. Well, I did. Yeah, yeah. I know. <laughs> oh, dear. <sighs> That's a disappointment, isn't it? Yeah, and on that massive disappointment, <laughs> the bed's quite nice. The bed's quite nice, yeah. Well, we said that in unison <laughs> then, didn't we? Yeah, that's not bad. Get to the uh, Yeah, you can get to that. Okay, that's just sort of blowing it for me. That is, that is ridiculous. Maybe you've got to turn it round. Yeah, the other way. Yeah, yeah. It is sort of pointing. Which way would you point it? <laughs> There's nowhere to point it. <laughs> no, doesn't work. No, no, no. Yeah, I know you were doing so well. Yeah, never mind the flaming shower. Right, the essential room is yeah, not. Yeah, no, come on, let's find something else. Sorry. Okay. So this is Deflefs Pulse GT T7051 DBM. And that's a name and a half, isn't it? If you ever. So 445 is the payload, and this is a 3,500 kilogram chassis. Massive, massive garage. Yeah. Do like their garages, don't they? Yeah. No reversing camera. Okay. Again, quite a it's quite a step up. Got a nice little running board there. Alloys. Best to have a look inside, I think. You need a double step to get in this, don't you? Mm. They like the doors, though, nice and big. Big wide doors, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So it's a slightly different sort of cupboard, cupboardry. Yeah. A swish. Tiny cupboard. It's a huge door. A tiny cupboard. Because it's under the uh, drop down bed. It's under the drop down bed, yeah, which is just up here. Fortunately, it doesn't line up this time. Does it not? No. But it must lower down. Okay. But yeah, there's plenty of headroom here. So you can get in there. There's no lights on in this van, so I'm able to use my own little light corner three thing there. I've switched the lights on for us. Now oh, you've got combi oven. <laughs> Good sink. Reasonable kitchen space. Controls for the drop down bed. It's our fridge. Yeah. Got our fridge. Yeah. Bonus, bonus points for that. Mirror. Uh, this is slightly different. So you've got shower there. Very nice shower. With hanging rail. Slidey round thing. Shut you off door. <laughs> yeah. Very stylish bathroom. It says push. get in this toilet yeah that's okay right it gets marks for the toilet well, it's better, isn't yeah it? better yeah. than that other one we looked at door to close off this area the bed is nice and low compared to the rest of the van yes yeah. yes that's very nice Yeah, I like this. No, this is very good. 
step back. There's a little step here, a yeah. little step here, and there's a little step there to help you in the bed. But you don't, to be honest, you don't really need it. No. Oh. What's your opinion? Well, I haven't looked in the uh, back yet. What about the lounge? You've got this massive huge table. Table. Um, a tiny little seat over here. Yeah. Um, I'll just see if I can fit me bum on. Oh, yeah. I think that's Poppy's seat. <laughs> I think there's only Poppy can fit on it. This yeah. these are quite comfortable. These. Um, yeah. yeah. It's a nice, um, nice, quite a nice atmosphere sitting in here. Yeah. But yeah, it's four berth. I, we wouldn't need the drop down bed. No. But it's there, isn't it? The telly's there. That's quite a nice place for the telly. Hmm. Is if you can sit here. Yeah. Well, we'd normally sit on these seats, wouldn't we? In theory. In theory, I'd normally sit on it. Yeah, I don't think even Poppy would fit on there, would you? Good point. Well, I suppose for a child, it's. Uh, yeah, I suppose so. Yeah. Love their dials, aren't they? Yeah, you've got to admire deaf lift dials. So you've got a lot of cupboards in here, have you? Have you not? Well, no. There's, there's a great big one here. Oh, you mean? Well, you know why you don't got lots of covers, don't you? Oh, we've got that. All right. Yeah, the, 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 those are pretty pointless. So that one there, isn't it? <laughs> wow, that's bites. That's Grand Granville's cupboard. That one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, you've got a massive garage, haven't you, sir? Yeah, I suppose so. Yeah, and you've got. Yeah. Quite a few cupboards in the bedroom, yeah. Um, yeah, it's got a wardrobe in the bedroom, two wardrobes. Yeah, plenty of space, plenty of space to put your infill cushions. Another infill cushion. What do you need infill cushions for? Nice little mm -hmm. drawer under there, yeah, yeah, you know, that's. We've got another one there. We've got another drawer here. Don't really know why they need infill cushions because it's only supposed to be four berth. Got like map pockets here. Yeah, it's an interesting layout, and I, I, I was taken by the the lower the bedroom. I think the bedroom's great. Skylight up there. Yeah, it's all right. Quite like this, yeah. seventy thousand pounds. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Well, three quarters. <laughs> of it. Right, we're on the sunlight stand, and we were looking for the T sixty nine L, which you don't appear to have. They've got three T models. Yeah. And the only one we can find that's anywhere near it is the T sixty eight. I think yeah. the T69L is a rear twin bed one. No, it's a rear island bed. Right, you, sorry. You want to look at. Rear island bed. But it seems to have a similar A similar lounge end. here, so perhaps have a look at this anyway. Yeah. So this is a Sunlight T68L. It's 3,500 maximum uh, gross vehicle weight. 42, uh, 452 kilograms it uh, yeah. payload. And it's 7.4 metres long. This one's got. So it's, it's a it's special that, edition, yeah. A 15 year edition. So they're, they're offering £12,649 exclusive bonus pack here. And, and, it, bonus. and it's all, all of these things. Sure, like pretty standard things to me, but never mind. It's an adventure bonus pack. Okay, let's have a look it's inside. Yeah, it's a fair way up. Drop down bed. It's quite nice. Quite pleasant, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So what you got? I'm really expecting with sunlight a, a slightly um, cheaper version, isn't it? Yeah. 
It's Hi, it is Heimer Group, isn't it? It's the Heimer Group, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's okay. The seat is actually a sensible that is size a nice seat, compared yeah. to the deaf lefts. Yeah. You can actually sit there. Yeah, well, that's comfy as well. Mm. Oh, this is? Yeah. Very nice. Yeah, you haven't got much of a seat there, have you? So you no. It lose no. that. And this table is not overly big. No. Yeah. Okay, let's have a look over kitchen area. Oh, so I'm tending to duck now. I've got in the habit of ducking, but I think that's all right. Thetford fridge. Nice big wide Thetford fridge. Oh joy. <laughs> <laughs> that's great. Yeah. Truma, isn't it? Truma, blown air. A sensible design, is it? That's bashing against the tap there. Right? Oh, yeah. Because if you put your tap around like that, you're alright. Yeah, but <laughs> come on. <laughs> well, that's nice. Yeah. Do like it's that. It's a good size. Yeah. Combi and oven. Yeah. Little drawers like. Yeah, that's quite right. nice. Moving back, we seem to have looked at so many vans today that got the s virtually the same layout, and there you've got know, the beds yeah. at the back. Yeah. Yeah, and you've got this centre shower room. I don't suppose there's anything else you could do really once the beds at the back. No, no. But that's quite good. It's a nice square area. It is, isn't and it's it? quite big, so there's plenty of elbow room in there. So I presume you can shut this off. Yeah, and, and there's a mirror in there. And let me just have a look at this. Take that in. That's like shelves, a bit of hanging, cupboard, two two steps up into the bed. Yeah, and the sitting up room. You've got a double thing to make it into a huge, massive, massive double thing. Massive double thing. Yeah, massive double thing. I'd leave that at home. <laughs> <laughs> It's, yeah, it's very stylish in here, I'm quite impressed. Well, it's light wood, makes yeah. it feel big, doesn't it? But why do they have to do this? Look, there's a shelf there, isn't there? Yeah. That could be a little cupboard. Yeah, well, it's just about. Well, it could, it could be a little cupboard. You've put anything up there and you move the van, it's going to be everywhere right. by the time you arrive. Yeah. So are your little wardrobe, you've done that, have you? No, I haven't, I haven't been in my little wardrobe. No. Yeah, oh, it's got in there. I'll switch my light on, and there's actually a light in there. Yeah, oh, that's good. It's a little bit of a. Oh, get down on my knees. Yeah, you'd be reaching about in there, wouldn't you? I suppose you could probably access it from, from there, couldn't you? Yeah. Of course, the reason for this van is the garage, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm quite, I'm quite liking this. Yeah. Once I like, I don't normally want to leave. leave. So you'll have to leave you here then. You leave me here, yeah. yeah little, things like a little pocket there. That's nice, yeah. Yeah. Well cry. Yeah. It does remind me of a Heimer. Reminds me a little bit of um, the Heimer Tramp. Yeah, yeah. TV. Yeah. Not seen a TV. No TV. No TV. <laughs> is it? No, that's for stopping the bed, isn't it? Yeah. This is one of the beds. Can't see any TV points. No. We spent ages looking for a USB. There it is. Just one USB. That's the only one I've found so far. Unless yeah. they're hidden away in a cupboard the somewhere. Plugs. Oh my goodness, the TV's in here. Oh, right, right up there. With the satellite unit. Right, so what it pulls out. Yeah. Oh, it's 
a complicated looking bracket thing. Right. I suppose you can then, if it's sort of like there, if you're sleeping yeah. in this bed, you probably can see it. Yeah, yeah. It is way up there though, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, not bad. So this is the Lyceo Time T Limited 690. 3,500 kilograms, payload 5,200, uh, 5,200, 520. And it's rear beds again with a garage. And it's on the, that's interesting, it's on the 120 brake horsepower engine. They've got an interesting upgrade, the show. <laughs> One pound to up to 140. I don't. I think I'd have the upgrade. <laughs> <laughs> I'd definitely get the upgrade. <laughs> How bizarre! Again, massive garage. It's quite a tall-looking thing, isn't it? But I suspect that's because the beds are way up there, aren't yeah. they? But it's it's a handsome-looking thing. Quite like the look of it. Can't get round the other side, so might as well go in big wide door. I do like the wide entrance doors, don't they? Yeah, so this is quality. I like this. And there's a really nice little touch here. I presume it's an umbrella stand. Yeah. I think that's what that is. Probably. Where are the big bottles? Silvered switches. TV up there. These seats, oh these seats are, oh they're excellent, <laughs> very nice to the touch. Small table, not too big, gives you plenty of room to get through here. Three burner, gas, which is the point where I say no oven and then discover there's an oven somewhere, but I can't see where, where the oven is. What's a little look at that? Yeah, see, I thought, see the right. No, you're, you're, missing, you're missing this. Yeah, no, no, but then Seen I looked that. up at that yeah. and I thought maybe that's just for giant bottles. To go giant bottles. Go with the glasses. <laughs> giant bottles. Oh, yeah. I thought you didn't hear me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look. That is an excellent wet room. Plenty of room in there. Great big mirror. On here. Oh yes, you've got your famous toilet roll dispenser. Oh, yeah. <laughs> a bit of a burst in a trademark that is, isn't it? It's rather spoiling it, it's got a shower curtain. This was the advantage of shower curtain, it takes up less room in a small bathroom than a small washroom. Mm. It's Truma. And it's Truma, yeah. Slimline fridge. Oh, yeah, how many times have I said slimline fridge? Oh, that's a good, good start. Someone's broken the catch there. Dear. Well, this is a way up. Three steps to get up here. <laughs> Shake of a head. But yeah, even even up here, I can still sit up. So it's not a bad place to be. Got like the Roman blinds, open shelves, little lockers at the back. I could at least put one extra locker in there. This curtain type concertina blind to close it off. That ladder presumably is in is if you make this into a huge double you need a ladder to get up there. Get up there, yeah. Because yeah. you've got no drop down bed in here. No. This is nice seat to be. But in. it's very nice seats. Yeah. Very nice seats. Just not sure about the bed. Well, that, that's that's too much. Three steps. What is for me anyway? USB points over in the corner. 
in the, those two things. And well, they look. I'm just looking at them. They look like clips. So I'm not quite sure what that's for. And you clip something to it. No doubt someone can explain it to us. This is, yeah, this is hanging space in these cupboards there. Oh, I don't know what that's for. No drop down bed in this one. No, it's a, it's a nice tall so, yeah. ceiling. It's just, well, it's huge, isn't yeah. it? It's way up there. Looks like it's got a sat nav with a. Yeah. Built in sat nag. Pioneer sat nag. Yeah, very nice. I like that dial thing. Magnet things. Up there. Yeah. The controls there. Lots of light switching things. <laughs> like Joddle Bank. Right, I haven't said that for a while. <laughs> Not sure what's going on there, but never mind. No cooker. No cooker, no. Not that you've got a lot of space to no. do much in here. No, not really. But they are they are big drawers. Oh yeah. Well, yeah. You take a lot of cutting with you. Yeah, you could take about a ton of cutlery, couldn't you? As long as you don't take more than your payload allows. But yeah, it's very stylish. Onwards. So this one is the Harmony Line Lyceo TD744 from Bursner. Well spotted. Great big awning, massive awning up there with a with an LED that runs all the way along. And assume, I assume, that, well that is the garage, but is that fixed? I don't know. So there's something about a double floor on this one, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, double floor facing. Okay, so automatic transmission. So if this is the one we're thinking of, this has got a double floor facelift, 68,995 and payload is 980. That's a good payload. Yeah. Because this is on a 4,250 4, kilogram chassis. Right. See the difference a bigger chassis makes? Yeah. 160 brake horsepower engine. Our alloys. Yeah. And it's a transverse bed at the back, isn't there? Just have a look at these seats here. Yes, these, nice. these are leather seats. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'll just take the seats. Yeah, very nice. There we go. Just having a little look around drop down bed up there is it manual or electric? no it's electric you can see the controls right okay over there oh yeah and it's got a swing out table so it doesn't make the table overly in the way does it but no. you could presumably you can swing this out so if you're sitting where I'm sitting and for the person over there and for the person over there yeah. No, but it's, you're not banging your legs on it, are you? No, no. It's got all the carpets in there, so I'm not sure I'm going to be picking up the carpets to have a look at the underfloor bit. No. But presumably there are lockers under there. Oh, look, this is different. Yeah, oh, I remember now. This uh, has the benefit, you've got a lounge in the back, but you've got a drop down bed above the lounge. Headroom check, just about okay. Just okay, but you've got a, an L-shaped sofa. Wow. This gives this. Oh wow! Yeah. <laughs> I, yeah, I can see the reasoning behind this. This gives you acres of space here. Look at the floor space there. I know. I know. Really, really nice. Yeah. Oh, 
cupboards and it's like a little living room mm. isn't it mm. i think that that's what they're saying here home is wherever i am with you how nice Only thing is, you've only got one plug over there. Yeah, just one electric point over there. But you can't. You probably couldn't put a, t a telly in here no. with the drop-down bed. No. no. Always a compromise. Yep. Well, this is very nice. No, but it's a really nice lounge. Mm. Very, very nice lounge. It sort of begs the question: Why do you need a lounge up there? Doesn't it really? But could potentially be too many seats. Couldn't <laughs> <it? Yeah. laughs> And you presumably you can close this off. Yeah, it's got a slide, sliding door. Oh, it's on one of those little kit catches. There we go. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. No, I like this. A lot. It's not. I wouldn't. I wouldn't choose this van, but I can mm. see how this would work for people. Yeah. How long is it? I thought it said about. Oh no! no I'm glad you asked me that. I'll go and have a look. Seven hundred and forty-nine centimeters. Seven point four nine meters. So it's shorter than our van. So it's shorter than our van, but it's because you've got this drop-down bed. Bed, yeah, yeah. Hanging, great hanging space. Slimline fridge. Said that again. <laughs> I could just make a recording of me saying that, couldn't I? Here's the compromise, though, isn't there? Not much space there, but a good shower. And an excellent little sink. It's very nice. It has a, it has a real quality feel to mm. it. I suppose this again, if, if you can shut the door, you've still got feet room. It works. It works. It works, yeah. Kitchen wise, three burner, gas, combi oven, obviously spec for the UK market. Oh, <laughs> that's something I've never seen before. See that? Yeah. And that just covers up the sink. So you can get through then. It's easier than trying to find somewhere to put it. Yeah, so you don't have to find yeah, that's right, you don't have to put that somewhere. You've got, got hey, drawers here. Cutlery, Cutlery drawer. drawer. Yeah. yeah. Very nice. This is very nice. Yeah. And it, it's quite a surprise, isn't it? I think this yeah. would win our award for um, innovation, yeah. innovation, or didn't expect this award. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I just all I saw about it was it got a double floor facelift. Yeah, yeah, you know whatever I mean. that meant. <laughs> well, it is on a double floor. That's why it's so high up. Consumably, un under all this carpeting, there are, there are lockers as well. Yeah. I don't know if we can get access to them. Somehow. Hmm. Just ease it. Just lift your feet up. Yeah, there's lockers under there. Oh, right. Yeah. It's very nice. Yeah. Okay. Like this. Yeah. <laughs> Next. Next. <laughs>